नमस्कार वेलकम टू डी एन एन वॉइस ऑफ नेशन यू आर वॉचिंग प्राइम न्यूज इंडिया म्यांमार बॉर्डर मेते वेलकम फेंसिंग ऑन द इंडिया म्यांमार बॉर्डर बट कुकी कम्युनिटीज प्रोटेस्टेड द सेंट्रल गवर्नमेंट डिसीजन टू इरेक्ट फेंस अलॉन्ग द इंडिया म्यांमार बॉर्डर हैज बीन स्ट्रॉन्गली वेलकम बाय द मेते कम्युनिटी ऑफ मणिपुर वाइल्ड द नागा एंड कुकी कम्युनिटीज हैव अपोज इट सींग इट इज नॉट एक्सेप्टेबल टू देम In a post on X, Home Minister Amit Shah said on Tuesday that the Narendra Modi-led central government is committed to making the borders impenetrable. It has been decided to erect fencing along the entire 1,643 kilometers long India-Myanmar border. A patrolling track will also be built on the border for better monitoring. Permission to travel without a visa. This move of the center is being considered as a signal to end the free movement arrangement FMR with Myanmar. The 1643 kilometers long India Myanmar border spanning Mizoram, Manipur, Nagaland and Arunachal Pradesh is operated under the FMR. It allows people living near the India Myanmar border to move within 16 kilometers of each other. Areas without a visa or any document drug trafficking will be banned Manipur shares at least 398 kilometers long border with Myanmar of which 10 kilometers is fenced Anyway fencing the Myanmar border has been a constant demand of the Meitei community living in in Phal Valley They have been alleging that tribal terrorists often enter India through the open border Not only this drugs are also being smuggled into India through this route There will be no compromise under any circumstances The joint coordination committee of valley based civil organizations kokumi welcomes the decision to erect fencing along the India Myanmar border but caution that no land area of the state should be compromised during the process Kokomi spokesperson M Dhananjay said that if border fencing had been done 30 40 years ago we would not have seen this current wave of violence the kuki community objected he said that fmr undoubtedly leads to drug smuggling on a large scale not only this but due to the infiltration of illegal immigrants there has also been a huge demographic change which poses a threat to meite and the native population here on the other hand the naga kuki community in the state has expressed objection to this step off the center naga council against cancellation of fmr united naga council president ng loro said that we are against fencing the border and cancelling the fmr this is not acceptable to us As far as drug smuggling and infiltration from Myanmar into Manipur is concerned other alternative means should be found to deal with it Tankul NGO Long another major organization said that our stand is very clear We are completely against fencing the India Myanmar borders Arunachal CM is also welcomed Arunachal Pradesh Chief Minister Pema Khandu lauded the center's decision to erect fencing along the India Myanmar border saying the move will stop the movement of unruly elements across the border Arunachal Pradesh shares a 520 kilometers long border with Myanmar Khandu posted on Twitter that this is a big step in the right direction to make our borders impenetrable Thanks to Prime Minister Narendra Modi and Home Minister Amit Shah for this. 